Sculptures are so realistic they almost seem alive and hungry. Only shards remain of the mirror. It appears to have been shattered by a single violent blow. Top of this ornamental shield is shaped like a bat on the wing. Judging from the size of these pots, Katrina must really earn a lot. Where a bed would normally be is a closed coffin. It is an ornate affair, apparently custom designed for someone who expected to be in and out of it frequently. Suddenly you find yourself totally unable to move. You! What are you... How dare you! Try to kill me, will you? How dare you! You break into my home, steal away my child, kill my servant, Toby, and then return to kill me? After I befriended you and helped you, some hero you are. I should leave you here to rot. I should let the rats gnaw your bones while you hang there. Give me one reason, one excuse why I should not leave you here to die. Tell me you love me and then try to put a stick in my heart, no doubt. Don't you dare say those words to me. After all you have done to hurt me so far. The truth now, or I will make certain you regret lying to me. Why did you come here? I'll try to explain what you're doing in Katrina's bedroom. Trying to find an exit from the dungeon? Just couldn't pass up a chance to look at the helpless vampire, could you? Funny place to look for an escape route, wasn't it? I have decided that I still have a use for you. Alive. If you help me, you may still manage to leave Mordavia without my mark upon you. I want you to seek out the five missing Dark One rituals and return to the castle. Together we will summon the Dark One and bring eternal night to this land. You will help me, won't you? Or must I take more drastic measures to assure your obedience? You tell Katrina that you'll do anything, anything at all, if she'll just let you go and not rip your throat out. Very well. But because I can never completely trust you, I will make certain you carry out my bidding. By my will, I guess thee. Thou shalt seek the heart ritual of the Dark One. Thou shalt seek the blood ritual of the Dark One. Thou shalt seek the breath ritual of the Dark One. Thou shalt seek the bone ritual of the Dark One. Thou shalt seek the sense ritual of the Dark One. Return with these rituals ere three nights pass, lest ye suffer. Thus is your guess. So go and return with the ritual soon. I would not want you to suffer after all. <laughs> challenge.
What a good boy you are. You would never do anything to hurt me, would you? Unlike some others I could name. So, you have returned with the rituals. Good. Very good. We will journey at once to the Dark One's cave. Soon, it will be forever night and I shall never be at anyone's mercy again. Ya Avuzel, hear me, great Dark One. Open thy mouth that we may enter. Open thy mouth that will swallow us all. Open thy mouth of darkness, Ya Avuzel. We will be watching you. So do not even think of trying to betray us. The last ritual remains with the High Priest. You will need to take it before you begin the other rituals. Please, be careful. Yes, we would hate for anything unpleasant to happen to you. Enter now, and good luck. The gruesome creature is a cross between a squid, chocolate pudding, and your worst nightmares. It looks awake, alert, and as if it would enjoy having you for supper. A large book lies on the ground beside it. As awful as it now appears, Something about the creature's shape suggests that it was once as human as you. Something truly terrible must have occurred to change it to its current shape. This does not... This... This is not... This is not... This is... This is not... This does not seem to be the best place to do that. The horror is gross, slimy, and fortunately quite dead. You pick up the book and read it. It is the diary of the last boyar. It seems that the thing in the pit was the last boyar. Being a servant of the Dark One didn't do much for his looks or disposition. On the last page is the thing you have been searching for. The Ritual of Essence. Now you have all the rituals and the summoning of the Dark One can begin. The book crumbles into dust in your hands moments after you memorize the final ritual.